I sunk a bomb went off. A witness describes this dramatic moment when this car explodes in this driveway in Northwest Charlotte. A ring camera mm. shows the moment the explosion caused the vehicle to go up in flames and those flames spread to the house. Now this happened at a home on Wandering Creek Drive near Pleasant Grove Road and a woman who was inside is now in the hospital. Erica Jackson joining us now. She's been following this story for us and uh, has the very latest for us tonight. Erica. Yeah, I want you to take a look because the heat of the flames was so intense. It started melting the siding on the home next door. Right now, I'm going to have you take a closer look at this property across the street. You can see from the driveway up to the roof, that front right side of the house while wow, completely destroyed. And that once yellow sedan that's parked in the driveway now unrecognizable. Relatives tell me they are on their way to a burn center in Winston Salem to see the woman who was in that car when it exploded. Watch carefully as a woman steps into this yellow car in her driveway. Fast forward about 30 seconds. The car explodes as she's still inside. The woman darts out of the driver's seat as flames crackle in the back. I heard a big boom. I was in the house or what now, you know what I'm saying? Then came out. Neighbor Diego Ledbetter says he realized his neighbor was in the car when he watched his surveillance camera's footage. They showed the whole thing blazing. The car was just on fire at one point in time, and then the car led to the house being on fire. The video shows a man run out of the home. He tries to put out the car fire with a fire extinguisher. Ledbetter says he dialed 911 as the man was screaming for help. I seen my neighbor said that this car had a propane tank in the back and it had blow it up. Medic says the woman was taken to the hospital with serious burns. We spotted her family trying to salvage what's left in the home. Relatives tell us they're praying for her recovery. Ledbetter says he's grateful no one else was hurt. I'm glad my house didn't burn up. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, and family members tell me the victim is a parent. They say her young kids who live here with her, they were at daycare when the fire started. The Mecklenburg County Fire Marshal's Office is investigating what caused the fire. Live in Northwest Charlotte, Erica Jackson, Channel 9 Eyewitness News. All right, Erica, thank you.